Well, many of us have dreamed of starting our own businesses, and that often means taking a look and then making a leap. Well, two men in Utah County say taking that leap means saying yes to just about anything. Yeah, I wish there was more to show you right now. Starting a business is all about risk. This is usually where the coolers are. Um, we have sold out. And in this case, it's also about teamwork. Uh, you're probably jelly I'm and jelly. I'm peanut butter. A little right? more sugary. Chris Stoddard <laughs> and Marcus Sorensen aren't just friends, they're business partners. Double insulated walls. They're also relentless salesmen. These thick walls of insulation. Ask them about their coolers and they'll never stop selling. Since their coolers are selling so well, the only activity right now surrounds some of their other products. I call it being a hustler. I think really good entrepreneurs are hustlers. But hustling isn't enough. It also takes dedication. Yeah, yeah, I had to quit. They both had to quit. Multiple backpacks into the bigger boxes. Marcus left behind a high-powered sales job. It's actually a great job, but is you it liar. wasn't. I think it, I think it was. lie. No, no, no. You're I, forgetting history. <laughs> being so successful that they've sold out of their main product only happened because they seized opportunities. So when Marcus got an email, they didn't hesitate. I literally kind of like, yeah, yeah, whatever, Marcus. We're just like, nah, that's not going to happen. That's not a real thing. A business is like the ultimate creation. It was definitely a real thing. Sure, sure, some whatever, Marcus. Don't waste too much time. Quitting it has to make sense financially or else I can't risk my family's life on it. Both men are part of a new reality show on the Discovery Channel called I Quit. And then we got this email saying, hey, we want to do this casting call with you. And now I'm calling Marcus saying, what in the heck have you got us into? We're going to park the cooler underneath the tire. Both men say it was a little unnerving being followed around by cameras for the better part of a year, but they eventually got used to it. And then it was like, oh, man, did I say anything that's going to, like, insult somebody or... Insults or not. Oh, I'm just nervous. If business is all about taking risks... For a couple of salesmen, this risk was well worth it. To get Blue Cooler's name on national TV, like, we couldn't pay for that. So as you can imagine, the premiere of the show on Discovery Channel brought the company a huge amount of web traffic. Um, they say right now they are just trying to build back their inventory. So.